Good morning guys, how's it going? Today we are back with another High Point video and we are starting the day off in Asheville, North Carolina at the Omni Resort here. This place is ridiculous. Who would have thought that there could be such a huge resort? We have to walk like 10 minutes to get to the elevators and then like another 10 minutes to get to our room after taking the elevator. Anyways, all that aside, it is a really cool place. The architecture is awesome. It's very extravagant and crazy with uh, with the design, but it's very cool. Today we are headed to the highest point in Tennessee. Uh, we'll be there in about two hours. Uh, I'm gonna get some breakfast first and then leave, but it's still really close by. So yeah, it's been a great stay here, uh, and we're off on the road again for uh, more high points. And I will see you guys soon. Uh, once we get in the car with a bit more information about this high point. Okay, so a little bit more information about the Tennessee high point. It is called Klingman's Dome. Uh, it is actually 6,643 feet or just over 2,000 meters which is quite interesting because that's very similar uh, to the height of the North Carolina high point that we just went to. Um, and actually, this high point is on the border with Tennessee and North Carolina, so I have a feeling that if that, that Mount Mitchell back there didn't exist, then maybe we'd have the same high point for two different states. This high point is in a national park, which means drones are not allowed. Kind of a funny story uh, with national parks. The only other high point we ever went to uh, that was in a national park was in Texas and if you recall there were drone shots for that it's not because I broke the law it's because I literally stood 10 feet away from the border of the national park and flew it straight up in the air turned it around and then landed it so this one's a bit different it's pretty much in the center of the park so uh, not gonna be so lucky this time uh, but should still be a, definitely still be a good uh, good experience so, this is something I did in the last video too, and I'm going to explain it again just in case you didn't watch, which is, like I said, drones not allowed in national parks, but we're about one mile away from the entrance of the national park, so just going to get some shots while I can. Obviously, they're not, uh, they're not of the actual high point, it's just the area that matters, you know. Better than nothing.
It goes up over there, really, though. But it, if it's anywhere, it's gonna be like right here. Which it actually might be. Like here. Highest point I can see. Uh, is there a plate up there that says no? Right? No, no plate. They, it kept getting stolen. Okay. So they, what they say, the dome itself is is the marker. Oh, okay. Now if you go those rocks down there, there's a, there's a yeah, we there, saw those. Get that one. There's that one. What I mean, what that's is that? That's just a, a yeah, plaque. Just I I I think it I don't need, I think it tells the elevation, but it's not yeah. it's not going to be 6643. Okay, so I apologize not for uh, for not commentating uh, much back there, but as you saw, that was ridiculous. That was uh, ten times as busy as the second busiest high point we've been to. It's it's a little bit ridiculous considering how few uh, 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 how little actual infrastructure is in this area. How many people were there? It does intersect the Appalachian Trail, which could be a reason that people actually just want to see the Appalachian Trail and do something cool in the at the same time. Maybe that's why. Hard to know. It's in fact not even a weekend today. It's it's a Thursday. Um, I just don't understand. Um, as you saw in that little clip, uh, we could not find the marker for the uh, actual highest point in Tennessee. Uh, but the uh, National Park Ranger told us that, in fact, there is not a marker because it kept getting stolen, um, but there is a, a marker closer to the parking lot that doesn't seem to have any real value, and in fact, I think is in North Carolina, so yeah, not too helpful. It was a cool view uh, when, the vo when the fog did clear up for a couple of seconds. Uh, like a lot of these ones here in the Smoky Mountains, they are smoky they are foggy uh, and that means that the views can come in and out the hike was a little bit steep it was short just like the one that we did in Georgia um, but it was still a little bit steep all right anyways that's 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 my thoughts on that sorry for not commentating in the middle of the people maybe I'll, I'll try and <laughs> work on getting better at that but uh, hopefully still enjoy the footage hopefully still enjoy, enjoy the video and uh, be sure to leave feedback down below and leave a like if you enjoyed. And uh, yeah, we'll see you guys next time.